What is up guys? I'm Daddy Game Afraid and welcome back to another Pokemon Sword and Shield the news update video today. We're going to be talking about the brand new mystery gift events that are going to be taking place from now, which is live now. Again, now you can jump in and grab yourself one of these four Pokemon and then every week until we get that DLC, we smacked with a brand new Pokemon to get, and it also comes with a ton of items. You don't want to miss this. So let's just jump in to the article coming from Pokemon.com, where it says, Get Galarian, Mr. Mime, Ponyta, Colossora, and Meowth with hidden abilities, for cool Pokemon, and bonus items can be yours via Mystery Gift Inst. Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield. The release of the Owl of Armor, the first part of the Pokemon Sword Expansion Pass and the Pokemon Shield Expansion Pass is drawing near. To celebrate Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield, players will be able to receive four special Galarian Pokemon via mystery gifts starting May 22nd, 2020, which is today. There will be a new mystery gift each week each containing a Pokemon, Galarian Mr. Mine, Galarian Ponyta, Galarian Colossora, and Galarian Meowth, along with a variety of items. These Pokemon will also have hidden abilities, making them valuable additions to your team. Here are the release schedules for these exciting distributions, May 22nd. 2020 Galarian Mr. Mime with its hitting ability Ice Body plus a Lore Ball, a Moon Ball, a Heavy Ball, and a Dream Ball. So we get the Galarian Mr. Mime today inside of a Cherish Ball, I might add, with its hitting ability Ice Body plus you're getting a few more balls added to the game with the Lore Ball, Moon Ball, Heavy Ball, Dream Ball. I believe these are obtainable in the game. So there's nothing too, too, too special there. However, it is pretty cool that they just, again, giving us these for free. On May 29th, the mystery gift, I believe, is going to either change. It doesn't say that it will end. We don't have that written anywhere. But they are going to um, bring through Galaria Meowth on the 29th with its hitting ability, anticipation, plus a level ball, a fast ball, a love ball, a friend ball, and a beast ball, another beast ball. And if you've been stockpiling them like I have, this will be the third one officially inside of Pokemon Sword and Shield. June 5th, 2020, we're gonna get Colossara with its hitting ability, cursed body, plus evolutionary items, the sweet apple, tart apple, chip pot, crack pot, scratch, and whip dream that is pretty cool again if you don't have any of these evolutionary items they're pretty easy to find in a wild area to be honest and when we had that um apple tent event we got these apples we never got a um chip pot event with the um teapot and stuff like that but these stuff aren't too hard to find but it's pretty cool again that they are giving these out for free and then on june 12th they are ending it with galarian meowth with its hitting ability universe plus a hundred XP candies, large size, and 50 big nuggets. Now, this is crazy because this is the last one, and this is going to be the one that's going to be closest to the DLC, and they're giving us 50 big nuggets. That is going to be a ton of money. That's a lot of money. That could implement or, you know, give us a lot of discussion points to talk about in the future, maybe in a later video, about what we're going to actually be doing in the DLC. Are we going to be taking our money over? Are we going to be taking our battle points over? Are we going to be taking our Pokemon over into this DLC area? And if we are, are we going to be overpowered? Are we going to be too rich? You know what I'm saying? Because 50 big nuggets, that's post-game stuff. That's like, here, buy everything you want. But with the DLC looming in, and we know there's going to be items we could buy and know that there's going to be new stuff to partake in, Will having so much money make it a cakewalk? Will having so much strong Pokemon make it a breeze to just every battle just flow through? Who knows? We need these questions answered, but we won't know until we get the DLC. But I think this is a huge clue about what's actually going to go down. The fact that they've given us 100 XP candies, a large size, alongside with 50 Big Nuggets, with the Glory Meowth, with its hitting ability. All these Pokemon have their hitting ability, which is, again, setting our teams up for greatness. It's giving us great Pokemon with this release this mystery gift release and i think it's pretty cool i think this is a way to again 
make sure players are turning on Pokemon Sword and Shield and getting ready and getting hype for this DLC. And especially giving out free Pokemon inside of those Cherish Balls is going to be cool because these Pokemon will be exclusive to those balls because the only way to get a Pokemon inside of a Cherish Ball is by getting it via Mystery Gift. In order for us to get the Pokemon, we need to launch Pokemon Sword and Shield, which is launch. We need to select a Mystery Gift. So go in, select mystery gift, and then go get a mystery gift, and then get via internet. And then it's going to connect you to the internet. Once you connect it to the internet, it should say Mr. Mine. It should say Mr. Mine on top with a couple of balls. With a couple of balls, oh my god. Hitting ability, Mr. Mine. Let's get it. Let's get it. I think I'm more excited than the fact that this Mr. Mime is going to be in a Cherish Ball. I love Cherish Ball Pokemon. My bank is full of them. I have a whole bunch of event Pokemon boxes um, from basically the beginning of time. Ever since I started playing Pokemon. What is this item? Send gift? I got something else here. Is these the items? Like the balls that came with Mr. Mime? Yeah, these are the balls that come with Mr. Mine again in a different mystery gift, but again available right now that you can get in game, and that's pretty cool. Let's go and look at this Mr. Mine real quick before I end this video. So here is our baby. He again comes in the Cherish Ball, level 15, Ice Psychic Mr. Mime, Galarian Mr. Mime, Copycat Encore Ice Shard Confusion. Okay, and it does come with again the ribbon which is pretty cool this is the nature i got um native i'm unsure if it's nature locked is it nature locked in past games when we got mystery gift events and stuff like this they have been um haven't been nature locked so i wonder if you could soft reset however if you don't mind the cherish ball like if you want it in the cherish ball with a certain nature then you could soft reset for a particular nature however if you don't mind it and just want the Mr. Mind so you can have its hidden ability. You can always breed the hidden ability now, now that you got one with the hidden ability if you weren't able to get one before or prior. Now this is cool again. I'm gonna be doing videos updating you guys every time a new one comes out. Let me know your thoughts on this. I'm doing this event where we're getting brand new mystery gift Pokemon. Granted, it's not new Pokemon in the game, but they are giving us a new exclusive by adding a Cherish Ball. You might think it's just a ball, but to me, it means everything. That red ball means that the Pokemon Company gave me that. And then to know that I have that in my bank or, you know, when I do want to bring it out and use it, I do tend to go for those Cherish Ball Pokemon because to me, they mean just that more to me. And I mean, maybe I'm, a, I'm just that crazy guy. But let me know how you think about that in the comment section below. Are you going to be using this Mr. Mind? Do you need it for your Pokedex? Or are you just going to try to integrate this into your team? Because again, it does have its hidden ability. So this is a easy just pick up and just have and you can just try it out. Let me know your thoughts on it in the comment section below. As you guys know, I answer all comments. This is a discussion. I want to talk to you guys about some Pokemon. Now, they've got some Pokemon news coming. Thank you. Jesus, there's some Pokemon videos coming back to the channel. As you guys know, I love this is this channel started with, with Pokemon. And then now, you know, basically since the news has kind of dried up, I've been jumping around and just been posting videos of games that I've been playing. And it's been fun. But I think the core of this channel is Pokemon. And I do want to do more with Pokemon. But there hasn't been so much content update with Pokemon that I was like, I'm not going to force it. I'm just going to let it happen organically. And this is one of those that I'm letting it happen organically. And it's just wonderful to see. Let me know in the comment section below if you agree. Peace. I love you. I'm going to see you guys on the next one. And yes, let's go. Pokemon content. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
for making it to the end of this video. If you're not a subscriber and you made it this far, hit that subscribe button. You know you want to join the family, ring the bell so you can be notified on the next time I drop one of my videos, as well as hit the like button on this video so it could be recommended so more people can check it out so we can have more people join in the family. If you want to keep up with me on other social media platforms such as Twitter, Instagram, or TikTok or whatever, I'm Daddy Gamer Fred on all of those. Again, Daddy Gamer Fred, you'll be able to find all those links in the description of this video and the pin tweet comment on my Twitter. Also on all of my videos, I do answer all comments. So again, if you just want to chat it up about the video or anything, just hit me up in the comment section below. I take time out of my day and literally answer to all the comments that you guys leave me and I love it. And again, let's have that conversation down there. Here are a couple of suggested videos that you guys should check out that may be of your interest. I am a variety channel. I do tons of stuff, tons of Pokemon, but tons of other stuff as well. So dive into these videos. Peace. I love you guys. I'm going to see you guys on the next one.